everybody. We are here yet again for another Rush album. What is this album now? Presto is where we are at. After so many albums, we are here. Let's see if we can count how many albums we are. Rush, Fly By Night, Caress of Steel, Farewell to Kings, Permanent Waves, Moving Pictures, Signals, Grace Under Pressure, Power Windows, Hold Your Fire. Okay, so this is 10. Please, if I missed one, Jesus. I am, I'm just, okay. So I'm just biding time. Y'all know how it is. Y'all know how it has to be. But hey, we have gone through so many Rush albums, not even counting the uh, live albums we have uh, and that we still have to go through. We are not even close to being done with the Rush discography, but here we are with uh, Presto. Uh, I, I don't know what direction they're going to go in on this album. Uh, I'm very just uh, low expectations. So, we're going to be a little bit surprised, you know. Yep, I'm all comfy and ready to listen to some Rush, dude. I hope you're ready, because uh, we got an album here. First song we have is Show Don't Tell. So, really excited to get into it. So, put on your headphones, everybody, because we are about to jump in to another Rush album. Here we go. have to reflect on that intro what it what an energetic intro first off alex's playing is wild here the sliding it's just so powerful and it's progressive wow they managed to <laughs> all right what an opening we have to listen to it one more time and then we'll keep on going with the rest of the song oh gosh i can't wait all right here we go
Quite the fade out on that one. So wow. What a start to an album. I really loved how energetic the song was. It was really cool. You know, it was so busy. There were so many sounds. You know, just like the last album, there was a lot going on. There was a lot of guitar, like different gu guitar sounds. Uh, you know, there was the acoustic guitar that I heard. At some points that you heard Alex just flicking along. Um, and then, of course, yeah, the wild intro. That intro is just crazy. I gotta see... Excuse me. I gotta see Alex play that live. That... That seems wild. Uh, so far, it's an A-plus song. Getty's bass also makes an appearance towards the end of the song and... Uh, it was fantastic. Um, I love hearing Getty's riffing. It is the best. Uh, it just really shows that they are still Rush. And uh, the chorus of this one, they're trying something a little different. The show me, don't tell me. That was really interesting. I like it. Overall, yeah, the song is a A+. Plus, a plus for me. Um, and Neil. Uh... The percussion was um, a plus as well. Yeah, this song was crazy. Yeah, the uh, the way this song starts out, you wouldn't think that it would uh, go the way it goes. <laughs> uh, so I think that really sets the theme for what's going on. Don't don't set any expectations because this album is about to surprise you. Um, so I'm excited going forward. Uh, so we're gonna do what we did last time. And um, look at the lyrics after we listen to two songs, because that's just uh, how I think we're going to go from now on. Um, it helps me out a little bit, you know, stay into the music, really analyze the music first and foremost. And then we'll get into the lyrics as a secondary portion of the video. So if anybody has any objections, go ahead, tell me in the comments, you know, who likes this format, who doesn't. Whoa. Um, you know, do you want to hear the lyrics uh, right after the song? You know, just let me know what you want. All right, folks, we're going to get into the second song on the track list. This one is Chain Lightning. So I like that name for, uh, for a song. Also, by the way, I did not even bring up what this album even looks like. Like, here's the YouTube video I'm on right now, and it's like, uh, rabbits. Presto. Oh, like a magician. <laughs> of course. Yes, I, um, you know, now that I get a closer look as well, uh, yeah. Rabbits coming out of a hat on a hill. All right, you know, it, it makes a little bit more sense now. <laughs> it makes a little bit more sense now. All right. It's pretty cool, though. How many, which of the rabbits is Getty? Which one is Alex? All right, we're just gonna jump into the song. Mm. 
Okay, just real quick, I gotta say, I love how odd this song sounds, you know, just uh, how eerie. I love the, um, just the overall feel of the song. I love the composition. It's really cool. It um, just sounds kind of like a punk song, you know? It's really cool. It has a lot of, a lot of flavor to it. Wow, a lot of attitude. Um, it almost did not even sound like a Rush song, right? But I still like it. Getty's voice is great in this one. Uh... All right, let's just rewind it just a little bit. All right, here we go. Wow.
What, dude? <laughs> okay, before we start that song. What? Oh, what? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. So, <laughs> my list of uh, favorite Rush songs keeps on growing. I loved that song. That song sounded so cool. It sounded so, like, sinister, like, evil. They got real creative with this one. I love that voice at the end. Like, what the heck? <laughs> Whose voice was that? Anybody know? Um... And I love the contrast between the uh, the chorus and the uh, you know the verse sounds like, oh, and that solo, the bridge section, oh my gosh, that was the coolest. Yeah, no, this is like one of my favorite songs. I just love the creativity. It just sounds so like, it sounds like a metal song almost. Like, <laughs> uh, it's really cool, really cool. Uh, definitely a different style for Rush. Did not expect him to go here. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, no, Alex's solo too really stood out in that um, in that bridge section. Like, I seriously want to give this song another listen. I'm obsessed with this song, Chain Lightning. What the heck? Yeah, so far both of these songs have intros that do not show what the whole song's gonna sound like. <laughs> they are misleading, and I think. Presto, we did a trick, right? That's what they're doing to us. <laughs> Overall, yeah, no. This album is a A plus for me. Honestly, any song that is able to still take you on a roller coaster of emotions like this, this is fantastic. Both of these songs. Gosh. Y'all see why I'm doing all these videos? Because <laughs> like their music is genuinely fun. Like, anybody who doesn't have fun listening to Rush is valid because they probably have something else they like doing that's not listening to Rush, and that's cool, too. You know? <laughs> Anyways, uh, so that's going to do it for this video, but no, it isn't. Um, but anyways, before we get into the lyrics, I do want to give a shout-out to my gold-tier patrons. We have Adam, Sanford, Gary Milstead, HRH, King Lurkst, Joseph Wilger, Onyxia, Peter K., James Owen, Chuck Dye, Jim Tatro, Mark Gedemeyer, Thomas Wideoff, Dirk, Robert D. Hassinger, and Brett King. Thank you all so very much. And here you can see the rest of the patrons. Thank you all so very much for joining. Uh, I really couldn't do any of this without each and every single one of your support. So, thank you. All right, so we're going to read the lyrics for Show, Don't Tell. How many times do you hear it? It goes on all day long. Everyone knows everything, and no one's ever wrong. Until later. Who can you believe? It's hard to play it safe. But apart from a few good friends, we don't take anything on faith until later. Show, Don't Tell. You've figured out the score. I've heard it all before. I don't care what you say. You can twist perceptions. Reality won't budge. You can raise objections. I will be the judge and the jury. I'll give it due reflection. Watching from the fence. Give the jury direction. Based on the evidence. I, the jury. Show, don't tell. Hey, order in the court. Let's try to keep it short. Enough of your demands. Witness, take the stand. Show, don't tell. Hey, order in the court. Let's try to keep it short. I don't care what you say. Let's see, Exhibit A. You figured out the score. I've heard it all before. Enough of your demands. Witness, take the stand. Hey. All the while, show me, don't tell me is in parentheses. Show me, don't tell me. I really like the song. But, uh, I'm not quite sure I'm catching the meaning real quick. Let me uh, look at these lyrics real quick. How many times do you hear it? How many times do you hear it? It goes on all day long. Everyone knows everything, and no one's ever wrong. Until later. Okay, so that's like reflecting on the fact that some people just like to boast and lie and exaggerate a lot of the time for no reason. And, you know, 
no one's ever wrong. Like they don't believe that they're wrong at all. They have full confidence in their statements. Wow, a very interesting song. I'm re I, I'm re having a lot of trouble grasping the concept. It's very abstract, right? Okay, I'm gonna have to have your help. Um, I mean, I got the first part. You know, don't trust uh, everything by what people say. You know, do your own research, right? I mean, I guess. Show me, don't tell me. I guess that's what it's about, right? Show me some evidence. Okay, maybe that's like the general meaning. Yeah, just please show me. Prove it to me, right? Is that kind of is that is is that kind of it? I don't know. It might be just like a general being like I, don't, I have no idea, dude. I don't want to guess. Somebody, please help. All right, let's go to chain lightning lyrics. Energy is contagious, enthusiasm spreads, tides respond to lunar gravitation, everything turns in synchronous relation, laughter is infectious, excitement goes to my head, winds are stirred by planets in rotation, sparks ignite and spread new information, respond, vibrate, feed back, resonate, sun dogs fire on the horizon, Meteor rain stars across the night. This moment may be brief, but it can be so bright. Hope is epidemic. Optimism spreads. Bitterness breeds irritation. Ignorance breeds imitation. Sun dogs fire on the horizon. Meteor rain stars across the night. This moment may be brief, but it can be so bright. Reflected in another source of light. When the moment dies, the spark still flies. Reflected in another pair of eyes. Dreams are sometimes catching. Desire goes to my head. Love responds to your invitation. Love responds to imagination. Respond, vibrate, feedback, resonate. Yeah, it's like a song about how, you know, humans interact with each other, communication. You know, like, uh, yeah, energy is contagious, like the first line of the song. You know, you hang out with a group of people that you find really interesting, you know, you just start spreading ideas, you know, sparks fly, so to speak. Yeah, like chain lightning, it bounces, turns into love. Yeah, so this is cool. This is a really cool song. Uh, it goes all the way to talking about meteor rain, stars across the night. Sun dogs fire on the horizon. That's really funny. What do those lines in particular exactly mean to you? This is a fun song. Uh, did not expect the lyrics to be like this at all. Like the song was so like interesting, right? Had so many shifts in uh, attitude and uh, tone. Such a wild song. Did not expect the lyrics to be like this. Yeah, give me some more information on this song. All right, well, uh, that's going to do for this first introduction to Presto. So thank you, everybody, for hanging out. Uh, if you want to check out the next video, just stick around. It'll be out probably tomorrow. So have patience, folks. All right, <laughs> I will talk to you in the next one. Uh, but first, make sure to leave a like and a subscribe. That would really help me out. Uh, and make sure to go check out my other Rush videos. If you haven't, just go to my channel and type in Rush and you'll see all my previous Rush videos and uh, maybe some other bands that you haven't heard of that you might like. I don't know, dude. All right. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out. Uh, really hope you had a good time. All right. I'll talk to you all in the next one. Peace.